A lot of you may know that the square root of negative 1 is the imaginary number i. And some of you may even know Euler's identity, or that e to the i pi equals negative 1. But what is i to the power of i? Let's start with Euler's identity. First, we take the square root of both sides, which is the same as raising both sides to the 1 half power. The right side simplifies to i. Now, remember that raising the quantity x to the a to the b is the same as raising just x to the power of ab. This means that the left side simplifies to e to the i pi over 2. Then, we can raise both sides to the power of i. Applying our exponent rules again, the left side simplifies to e to the i squared pi all over 2. Remember, i squared is negative 1, so i to the i is equal to exactly e to the negative pi all over 2 or about 0.2079, which surprisingly is a real number. Pretty cool, right?